What's up everyone and welcome to I guess this is a uh, uh, Ola testing sh actually. What What are we doing right here? Why do I have all of these amplifiers and cabinets here in front of you guys? Well, I just received an amp and cab switcher from KHE. Look at this. So what this is right here, it's basically an amplifier and cabinet switches. So I can have all the amplifiers, all the cabinets set up in the room. I have them set up at the same time and then I can switch between the cabinets and amplifiers. And basically I can make the absolute best comparison video of all time. How about that? So before I went on this adventure of setting everything up, I uh, bought a shit ton of cables and I marked them all up. The cool thing about the KHE uh, amp switcher right here is that it also has an effects loop built in. So for every amp and cab, there are five cables each. So we have a guitar input cable, we have two cables for the effects loop, then we have the amplifier output, and then we have the cabinet and everything's routed through that amp switcher right there. So, yeah man, I'm excited. I spent the full day labeling, fixing all of this, so I'm, I'm just really excited to try it all out. Now, I'm using a couple different microphones. I'm using this Austrian Audio OC18. I'm also using two stereo microphones right here. Uh, so, now if I wanted to make this the absolute best comparison video, I would probably have, you know, four of these OC18s, one on each cabinet, but you know, I'm not the richest guy in the world, even though it seems so. So I'm using these stereo microphones over there, and this is basically just a first test, okay? And I figured I would film the test. Just try it out and, you know, look at my face, see how happy I'm gonna be. And uh, also before the amplifiers, I have this pedal board right here, which consists of uh, Ibanez Tube Screamer TS9, a 433 pedal, and these go in front of the amplifier. And then in the effects loop, I have a uh, Fortin Sewell noise gate and a Horizon Devices Play Echo. Is it Flux Echo? Sorry. <laughs> Shit. The amps will be labeled uh, one, two, three, and four. Pretty simple, right? Let's start with number one. We have my Marshall JCM 800 uh, 22, uh, 2205 into this Marshall cabinet with uh, Eminence Legend speakers, okay? <laughs> Okay, that was rig number one. Let's go to rig number two. So we have the Roadster Mesa Boogie and the Oversized Mesa. <laughs> Worth mentioning is that I have the Tube Screamer engaged right now, okay. That's the rig number two, the Mesa. Let's head over to Angle, which is an Angle Savage 60 watt into an Angle XXL with Vintage 30 speakers. And the thing is, you don't really need a tube screamer for an angle. That's the Angle Savage 60 right there. Let's try the Fortin Satan with a Fortin cabinet over there. What's up? Engage uh, tube screamer. So, yeah, let's go back to the Marshall. Oh, maybe I'm standing in the way right now. Let's 
Let's try the JCM in the Mesa Oversize. I could get a midi pedal and control this by foot, by the way, but I didn't have one. So this is just going to be me stretching down here, pushing the buttons, right? And immediately I hear how fucking amazing this Mesa cabinet is right here. It's just so good sounding. Holy shit. There's a reason why it's my favorite one. It's just, just sounds really good, man. Okay, let's try the... Oh shit, this was not the Mesa cabinet. This is the angle cabinet over there. Huh? Okay, let's try the Mesa cabinet. Angle. Worth noticing is that both of them have has uh, vintage 30 speakers. Uh, not sure if the one in the angles are British made or UK made, but the ones in this one is UK made. Uh, but the Mesa has a little bit more woof to it. Okay, how about the Fortin cabinet? Sounds pretty good. Okay, let's go ahead. Let's play my roadster for a little bit. Marshall cabinet and roadster. Yeah, yeah. I think the problem I have with me hearing it like this is that you instantly get a favorite cabinet. <laughs> and this right here is not the best match for uh, many amplifiers, I would say. Uh, maybe, maybe it's something I would need to switch speakers in, but right now there's the Eminence Legend Onyco speakers in it. <laughs> Okay, switch cabinet, rolls the cabinet, rectify cabinet. Angle. Fortin. Okay, let's try the angle amplifier with the Marshall cabinet. Shutting off the tube screamer. Rectify cab. Okay, angle cabinet. Uh, Fortin cabinet. Fortin amplifier with the Marshall cabinet.
something I want to try out now is to have the one in the same cabinet. I've chosen my uh, oversized Mesa cabinet and uh, I have my OC18 microphone over there. And now I'm going to try and switch the amplifiers using the same cabinet and see how much of a difference it makes. Okay, so we're starting with the Marshall right here with uh, the Tube Screamer engage. <laughs> Okay, Roadster. Angle. Fortin. It's funny, actually, how similar the Marshall and the Roadster sound through this Mesa cabinet right here. Check this out while I'm switching in between the two. So we had the Marshall first and then I switched to the Roadster. Holy shit, man. Yeah, so there you have it. Uh, that's a short little demonstration of this amp switcher right here. I haven't really decided how I should hook everything up. You know, if I should have where I should place my cabinets, maybe over there, somewhere else, I don't know. As I'm playing all of these amplifiers and cabinets, uh, you know, it kind of confirms the thought that I had and, you know, the theory I have that, you know, 80% of the sound comes from the cabinet and uh, obviously depending on where they're placed in the room will matter as well so you know the results may vary on the stereo microphones over there but i think and hope it will give you a perception of what it sounded like here today so there you go that's my little video for you right there if you liked it maybe consider putting a thumbs up and uh thank you so much for watching and also give me suggestions if you want to see me put some amps and cabs head to head with each other. Uh, let me know a couple of suggestions and uh, I'll think about it. Okay? Thank you so much, guys. See you.